Hey everybody, welcome to The Real Show Barbecue. Today we're going to show you how to do an easy breakfast on the EcoZoom rocket stove. Unfortunately guys, we had some problems with our footage and lost a part of it. So I'm going to kind of tell you about what we did today, show you a little bit of the footage that we have, and then also the end result. The EcoZoom rocket stove is a portable stove that you can use camping, at home, wherever you may be. It's very well built, but it's lightweight and easy to take around and we cooked it at home today. Now I'm also using some product by Newskis. I'm using some of their applewood bacon and their applewood bone and ham slices. I'm also using some of Running Wild Foods. It's their maple bourbon seasoning. It's awesome. It's what they call their, their pork candy. It tastes great on this bacon that we did today. So hang tight with us and we'll show you some of the footage. Here is the EcoZoom. This is a portable rocket stove. It's very lightweight, but at the same time, it's real heavy duty, like a cast iron top here. Now, we've had a lot of rain, so my wood and everything is wet around here, so we're gonna be using some lump charcoal today. But basically, you can just kind of lay your pieces of wood here and just kind of feed them in as the fire burns. You put the fire started in here, and then the heat rises up to where you can cook on your surface. And we're gonna be using a cast iron skillet today. So we're gonna go ahead and get started, put our lump charcoal in there and get the heat going and we'll start cooking. Got our lump charcoal on there. Hopefully you can see it. And we're gonna go ahead and light our tumbleweed and get it rolling really good. Put this another piece in there. Once the coals get to where I want them heat wise, you may be able to see it. A little bit of the flame is already rising up and that's what basically happens. The flame will rise up and heat the pan or whatever you're grilling on. So we'll get this where we want it and we'll get started cooking. All right, I've got our skillet on there. It's gotten nice and hot. I did manage to find a pecan limb, a little small limb that I broke up. It was dry. We've had hurricanes coming through here so we haven't been able to have a whole lot of dry wood around here. So I found this just to kind of see how it works. Just kind of slide the wood in there as it burns. I've got the lump charcoal in there going. We're gonna go ahead and flip our bacon over. It's crisping up nicely. Let me get this turned over. And then I'm gonna show you our seasoning that we're gonna put on here for some candy bacon. I went ahead and took a couple pieces of bacon up. My wife isn't wanting season on her, but I'm using this pork candy. It's a maple sugar bourbon by runningwildfoods.com. And I'm gonna put this on here on a couple pieces of this bacon. It is awesome. I've already tasted the flavor of it. It's got that brown sugar, nice flavors. All right, we're gonna go ahead and flip our ham. As you can probably see, I've moved this. Now, these are, these handles right here will not burn. I don't really suggest moving it, but I had to slide it out of the sun so you guys can see what I'm doing. So we're gonna go ahead and flip this ham over. Like I said, we're just trying to get a little bit of color on it. Hopefully you can see that, it looks awesome. Get a little bit more color on this. You just basically already cooked. And then we'll cook with some eggs and we'll be done. All right, we finished up our breakfast. Got some of that applewood bone in ham. Some of that applewood bacon that I put some of that uh, maple bourbon rub on and then we got some scrambled eggs got all that grease and all that goodness that came from that um, ham and bacon all into these eggs so they're gonna be great let's try the ham first this is some of that ham Nooski's ham so we're gonna give that a try oh my gosh that is so good some people right here call it breakfast ham but i tell you i could use that any time of the day the flavors are awesome that apple wood you can taste that a little bit it's got a little bit of some caramelization going on from the skillet that we cooked it in awesome flavors highly recommend it let's try the bacon the applewood bacon that i put running wild foods the uh, maple bourbon rub on there <laughs> my goodness you talking about something it is some kind of good that has got some great flavors right there Again, I didn't overpower it with that rub, but you can taste a subtle hint 
of that maple bourbon sugar. Oh my goodness, that is amazing. Mm -mm -mm. That is so good, guys. Go and check these out. Nooskies, I'll leave a link down below. Also, that EcoZoom rocket stove, portable rocket stove, man, it is great. It is a powerhouse to be as small as it is and portable. I will leave all this information below, running wild foods. Go and check them out. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. As always, if you're new here and you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. God bless.